Is there a way of getting any more goals out of Liverpool's attack? The Reds' lethal front three scored five times between them against Brighton yesterday, and that was without Sadio Mane. But if anyone can improve Jurgen Klopp's front line, it's a man they call the Gabonese goal machine. The Sunday Express says Klopp will target Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang, his former Borussia Dortmund striker, in a big-money January deal. This is bad news for Daniel Sturridge, who has enough trouble getting into Klopp's team as it is. The England man could be offloaded to AC Milan if Obama Yang arrives, although the Reds face competition from Chelsea for the 28-year-old African. Danny Rose may also be on the move next month, but only if Manchester United meet his £45 million asking price. The Daily Star Sunday says the Tottenham left-back is available for transfer after falling out with Spurs boss Mauricio Pochettino, but chairman Daniel Levy will, as ever, negotiate harder than an Istanbul carpet salesman. Read more Zlatan Ibrahimovic admits he rejected Arsenal trial bail for sale like a packet of supermarket chicken drumsticks approaching their Selby date, they succulents diminishing by the second under the hot glare of artificial lighting, Gareth Bale will soon be officially past his best. So, naturally, it's time for the oncey delicious Welshman to have big yellow reduced sticker plastered onto him. And it reads, H-A-L-F-P-R-I-C-E was £100 million, now £50 million, Manchester United are frequent visitors to the Real Madrid supermarket, although they often leave without buying anything because the produce is too expensive. However, the Sunday Mirror claims that a bargain basement bale could be just to the liking. Read more Southgate exciting Ali and England creators can hurt Belgium United have pursued the former Tottenham forward for many years, but they are reportedly set to pull the plug on a deal unless the price is right, which is where the reduced sticker comes in. Once the world's most expensive footballer, and habitually valued at £100 million, a series of injuries plus the fact he will soon be 29 have hit Bale's value. United are now only willing to pay £50 million, £60 million for him, and given his fitness record Madrid may find it hard to argue with a revised valuation. Big Sam draws up shopping lists meanwhile, Sam Allardyce is rubbing his hands together and looking at all the money HES been given by Everton, some for his own bank balance, and the rest for his transfer kitty. Big Sam will prioritise a striker and central midfielder, with the Sunday Mirror claiming that Watford's Troy Deeney and Sevilla's Steven Zonzi are his two top targets. Both would cost in the region of £25 million, which is roughly the same amount Sam has earmarked for a new heated swimming pool at his West Midlands mansion. Elsewhere, Man United have joined Arsenal and Barcelona in the race to sign Schalke midfielder Leon Goretzka Mail on Sunday, Crystal Palace are interested in out of favour Paris Saint-Germain goalkeeper Kevin Trapson on Sunday and Chelsea are prepared to let Thibaut Courtois leave on a free transfer when his contract expires in 2019, rather than sell him to Real Madrid for a hefty transfer fee next summer sun on Sunday. Because, at the end of the day, what does Roman Abramovich need with another £50 million?